up, what e nerdigans? This is the one and only Packer Girl 89, and today's manga nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Kikan Yuviwa uh, Monogat Monogatari Chapter 20, and this is the first manga nerdigan live reaction for this manga. And I binge read the hell out of this manga last night, and all my Kami and Arceus, I love it. I love the hell out of this manga. This really reminds me a lot of like a Rosario vamp, yeah, a lot of a Rosario vampire. Tenshi Muyo kind of thing, but the thing that I really love about this vampire is the love between Satoru and Hime, uh, or Princess Crystal. I really love that love there. So, like, even though he's technically married to the five princesses, or not five, it's four princesses, even though he's married to four other princesses, that he, that um, Hime is number one. He's the number one waifu. <laughs> I love it. Anyway, let, anyway, let's get to the manga. Oh, um, that's right. That stupid bitch in the Water Kingdom wants uh, wants Prince Maz to, to slay fucking Satoru. Don't do it! You will slay the Rain King and correct your mistake, Prince Mars. You will uh, be granted the Emperor's pardon in the hand of your beloved, uh, beloved princess. Because remember in uh, the last chapter, in chapter 19... Uh, we found out why Mars was originally going to become the Rain King was so that he could be with um, with one of the, with uh, Princess uh, Sapphire from the Water Kingdom because he was in love with her. I can see the future. Who are you, the Empire's dog? <laughs> I'm not. I am but a mere fortune teller. I have seen your future, and I know the emp Emperor's mind because I have foretold um, these things. What I foretell often comes to pass, like the attack of that beast. The Rain King hails from some other world. He has no right to be here. It was you who held the right to um, be the Rain King. You need uh, not trouble yourself. Or will you go against the Emperor's will again? You know what um, You know what that would mean. As the, the child of his mistress, your rank is, on, is your only worth. Having... Woo! So he's the child of a mistress! Oh, poor Mars! Oh! I want to give him a hug. Like, poor Mars, he's the child of a mistress. He's not even the child of a queen. Well, you could also say concubine in that in a way. Having lost the one you love, that is all you have left. This blade can bend the magical elements. It is an antique um, magical item spoken, spoken of in legends. I place it in your hands. You have uh, no power of your own, but with this, the Rain King will be no match for you. How um, did you come to have that? That is not important. What? How did this bitch get this shit? Like, who is she? I want to know who she is, because we know that um, she's, because we know she's, like, foreseeing the future, and she's manipulating uh, the king of the water, uh, the water kingdom, so. When you return to the empire with the rings, I'll be waiting. Until then, fare thee well. Don't let our father down, Mars. This is the will of the emperor. What should I do? Don't do it, Mars! Don't kill Sandro! All of our preparations wasted. You can't even bring us a single country. Um, you know what my ministers are calling you? A failure. Soon we'll select a candidate to be ranking. This is the, um, this is, now we're in a flashback. It's only an old wives' tale, but an effective way to control the peasants' minds. Even you should be able to handle that much. The fact that I acknowledge you as my son is your only value. Prove your worth, um, Mama Rubius. Oh, man, like... This is so fucked up. This is like compare. I'm going to compare this to Moggy for a second. But like think about um, Alibaba. Alibaba is the son of a prostitute. But the king acknowledged him as his son. And because he, well, for one, he loved his mother. He was in love with his mother. And he wanted him to become king. Like this king is such an asshole. He is the total opposite of the king of Alibaba. Um, uh, Bali Bad. Fuck you, dude. Fuck you, king of the empire. I hope and this is going to turn out to be some Akami Gakuru shit where he, his ass is going to die. What What am I here for? My love, my father's trust, I've lost everything. Slay the ring king. You'll be granted the emperor's pardon in the hand of your beloved princess. That's right. I only have one choice. You really don't need my help? That is not your a role. People like you are a last resort should the worst come to pass. Your, maj your majesty, we will hunt these beasts for you. Take care of things here. Uh, okay. Sato, we need, uh, we need to stay where it's safe and um, if anything uh, should come up. What's up? Jeez. Be careful. Oh, <laughs> I love Kime and Sato. They're so fucking cute. 
Will, will do. Don't blush, it's embarrassing. Uh, I don't know how not to. Then I shall grant you power. Hey, <laughs> hey, um, Gridart. Gridart is, oh my god, Gridart totally right, reminds me of Ryoko from Teji Buyo. She totally does. What? I'm also his bride. There's nothing strange about it. No, there isn't, but, um, we'll take care of things. We'll take care of things here. You go fight. Um, can I? Can I? And to uh, Nefarious? I can't. I'm left out of this. Oh, poor Nefarious. Like, it's hard to believe that Nefarious is, like, 54 years old, but elves, I guess, age really slow. <laughs> Even Neff's being aggressive. Then I'll do an extra one. That way I'm still special. That's cheating, Crystal. The Ring King's power lies in his bonds. If they wish to give him power, that's a good thing. This is too unspeakable for words, is it? Sigh. The beast will surely come here. In the chaos, it will be uh, easy, to slay the, uh, easy to slay the Ring King. We're counting on you, failed prince. New sir, the right and left flanks are pressing forward. Good. The beast uh, pack is um, uncannily like the fortune teller's prediction. If this keeps up, we have as good as one. Surrender. A single um, giant beast has appeared outside the expected area, the exact opposite of our position. It's going to get uh, past us into um, Massé Palace. We must peel off a division to intercept. No, we'll defend this spot with our lives. The palace is in good hands. What? It's the Kraken! Dude, that uh, octopus, man! It looks like it has I caught its face. It looks like the, just the, where the mouths are. It looks like pineapple upside down. Okay. It looks like, not pineapple upside down. It looks like fucking pineapples, man, on his face. Crap, that looks like the daddy from the one earlier, but uh, from the looks of it, uh, things, it's alone. Don't do it, Mars! Sato! Oh, good, Sato dodged. Mars! Ring King, I'm sorry, but you're gonna have to die here. Oh, no! Leave this to me. Sato, you take care of Mars. Mars, are you for real? Slay the Ring King. Give the rings to the Empire. That is my duty as the Imperial Prince. I no longer have any other choice. Hang on, why are you doing this? At least tell me why. You say it yourself. If circumstances call for it, I should just steal them. Turns out I need those rings after all. I leave you here. Gained your trust so I could do this. Ring King for the Empire, you will fall. Sato, he's acting strange. He's not himself. Some, uh, someone's controlling him. Then what should I do? Throw holy water on him. I don't know. I don't know, but for... <laughs> Throw holy water on him. <laughs> yeah, that would work. I don't... I don't know. I don't know, but for just now, just block his movements. Oh my god, when I need you most, you're always useless. <laughs> Fucking sage. I'm not good enough with the sword to go up against Mars. He was the one teaching me to fight, so I might have to hurt you a bit. Too bad. He blocked the magic. How? A sword that bends elements. I remember that blade. If a failure uh, like him wields it, it is a good fit for a failure like him. I knew it. The rings are speaking to me. Don't hesitate. If you unleash your full power, you'll overwhelm him. Leave no trace of him behind. Huh? I can't do that. Then you will perish? Oh, just shut up. I can't do what I can't do. Why not uh, use your power to thwart those against you, fool? I talk big, but what now? If I go all out, the rings could be right, but I can't exactly hold back against him. Right, I can't fight him. He's just so much better than me, so why am I uninjured? I knew it. Mars is Mars. Yeah! Mars is the one to kill him! He's just doing it for face. Sato and Mars are fighting? Why? I don't know. He aims to steal the rings, um, I suppose. He lowered his sword. You fool, you'll die. I thought so. You don't have it in you. You're too kind. Oh, damn it! Why does this chapter have to end? Damn it! Mars! I hope Sapphire comes and tells Mars to just knock it off, that she's going to be with him, and they elope and live happily ever after. Fuck, hell, if, if uh, Sapphire comes on the journey with them, because technically she was there, Sapphire... Um, was technically supposed to be the Rain King's wife. I'll be fine with that. Sapphire can come too. I'm fine with Sapphire coming. But, like, I want to know who the fuck is this fortune teller? Is this fortune teller working for the Empire? Like, why does the Empire want the ring so bad? R control the ring so bad? Like, do, does the Empire just want to, like, take control of the entire country? That's what it sounds like to me. 
But anyway, what do you nerdkins think of this chapter? And where do you think the story is going? I hope I hope it's going in the direction where Mars gets to be with Sapphire. Because I really love them as a couple. I'm pissed that Sage didn't get his love. His lost elf love. His long lost elf love. That was bullshit. Sage, you should have went back for her. Even though you're old and crusty. But whatever. Anyway, remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. Also, um, if you want to contribute to the Nerdigans Inc. expansion, there's a couple ways you could do it. You could donate to the Nerdigans Inc. Uh, Patreon or purchase something off of the Nerdigans Inc. Amazon wish list. Both links are in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitch. Um, subscribe to my Twitch channel and, um, and friend me on PlayStation Network. Everything is in the description box below. And until next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye!